Sometimes I've mentioned before that children will refer to a past life. They'll just bring it up out of, out of the blue. Now this mother wrote to me, she said, she babysits during the day. And she has a number of little, the little kids in their, oh, maybe three years old, the, the toddlers. And her own daughter had come home from school. Her daughter is 15. Her daughter had come home. And this little girl was sitting on the couch with a 15-year-old. So the three-year-old and the 15-year-old are just there together. And usually the little girl was chattering all the time. Chat, 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 chat. But today she was very quiet. She was thinking. And then suddenly, without any prompting, she just started to speak. And she said to the 15-year-old, she said, When I was big, I was driving down the street with my daddy. We had eaten dinner out, and we were late picking up my sister. My daddy drove right through a stop sign, and he crashed the car. I went through the windshield and laid on the ground for a long time before anyone came to help me. I died. When I was big, though, my name was Amanda, and I was big like your mommy. And this is a three-year-old talking to the 15-year-old. Well, the 15-year-old, once in a while, being in the rebellious years, had her questions about Eck and Carr and reincarnation and all those things, too. And so she looked at her mother and she said, Mom, did you hear what she said? Mother said, yes, I heard. And the oldest the older girl, she tries to get more information from the toddler, but it was as if the screen were pulled down. And that was it. The child said no more. And it just went about being itself. So the mother said, it pointed out for her again and for her daughter that reincarnation is simply another day in the life of soul. Now this is part of the true wisdom. We celebrate the resurrection too. And we celebrate this life as the resurrection. Because life always follows death. And it doesn't do it just one time. In Ek and Kar, we believe and know that this progression and this cycle occurs again and again. And many people are not at the point where they can understand this because it's not the time. They have many other things to learn that are very, very important. Not to say that the echists who've come further, let's say, further along the path as they think that they've solved all the problems of people around them, They haven't, but at least they've come to an understanding that there's a way out. There's a way off the wheel of reincarnation. 